Hello, welcome to our 10 minute wellness sessions that we are having in partnership with the Raytheon Virtual Fitness Center. Access to the Virtual Fitness Center is free for all Raytheon employees. Full classes are available on their website. Please access the Virtual Fitness Center through Healthy You. I will put the link in the chat. Amber, I will turn it over to you. Hi everyone, welcome to Midday Grind. My name is Amber, we are gonna be doing a little bit of a strength cardio workout today. So we are gonna be using a timer. The setup is gonna be 40 seconds of work followed by 20 seconds of rest. No equipment is needed. All you need is just a little bit of space for yourself. So all you need is to be able to reach out and have a full arm span out to the side and in front of you and you'll be all set and ready to go. We're gonna start with a warm up first. If you'd like to track a day's workout and you have a fitness watch, now is the time to press start. And let's go ahead and begin with our warm up. We're gonna begin first with some arm swings, crossing our arms in front, opening up and back, keeping those arms nice and straight, focusing on squeezing those shoulder blades in the back and getting that chest opened up and ready to go. Let's do one more arm swing, transitioning right into some marches, getting those arms pumping, bringing those knees up towards our chest. We're just gonna march in place, trying to get those knees as close to your chest as possible, getting those legs warmed up as well as those arms. Let's do one more march each side. And then last little warm up, we're gonna go into our butt kickers. Hips are pressing forward nice and flat, bringing those heels up towards our glutes, stretching out those quads and activating those hamstrings. Let's do one more each side. And now we're gonna get started with the workout. For this workout, we have two exercises. While I demonstrate both these exercises, I want you all to keep warm. So I want you just to keep stepping side to side, keeping that body active while I demonstrate, and then we'll get right into it and I'll press start on the timer. For our first exercise, we're going to stand with our feet facing forward, about shoulder width apart. We're gonna go down into a squat position, hips sink back, coming up tall. We're gonna add a heel raise, lifting those heels up before immediately going back down to that squat. We're going for speed today, only going as low as we can in a comfortable range of motion. If you would like, you need more stability, feel free to grab the back of a chair or a desk for some added balance. Exercise number two, we're gonna start same position, feet forward, about shoulder width apart. This time our arms are gonna be up. We're gonna be making some fists with our hands. We're gonna twist our hips to reach out, punching forward, coming in, and switching sides. We're twisting our hips, pushing through our leg, and getting side to side reaches, keeping those arms up. We're going for speed today, starting with our squat to heel raise first in five seconds. So get ready. Feet are apart, facing forward in three, two, one. Let's work. Squat and lift those heels up. Trying to move as fast as possible. Let's get that heart rate up and those lungs working. Keep breathing, we are halfway through. About 20 more seconds to go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Feel free to shake those legs out. Take a breather. Enjoy your short rest. We have 12 seconds left on this rest break. And then we're going right into our cross body punches. We're gonna set that up in five, four, three, two, one. Let's work, reach and twist. Pushing through that back leg, twisting those hips, getting a little bit of a core workout with that rotation through our trunk. Extending our arm out as far as we can. We're also going for speed here as well. Let's try to pick up that pace. 
We are over halfway with 15 more seconds to go for this round. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and rest. Let that body relax. Feel free to drink a water at any point today, especially during these rest breaks. We still have two more rounds to go. Starting in 10 seconds, we're starting back up with our squat to heel raise. Let's get ready in three, two, one. Here we go. Squat, popping up, lifting those heels. Try to get a little bit more repetitions in this round. Picking up that speed, moving just a little bit faster. We always want to challenge ourselves to do better each round. 20 more seconds left. Keep working. You're doing great. 15. Last 10 seconds. Let's go even faster. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Shake it out, shake it out. 15 more seconds of rest. Going right back into that cross body punch. In 10, get ready, get in position, starting up in five, four, three, two, one. Let's work, reach and punch. Taking those nice deep breaths. I like to inhale through my nose, exhaling through your mouth. That'll help you out a little bit if you're more prone to any side cramps. Making sure we're taking those nice deep breaths will help offset that. Halfway through, keep moving. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Rest. We have one last round to go. Let's give it all here. In 10 seconds, last round, squat to heel raise. In five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Squat, popping up tall, lifting those heels. Moving faster with each round, making sure we're still maintaining that good form. Our back is nice and flat, and our knees are tracking with our feet. 20 more seconds. Almost there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Shake it out, shake it out. One less exercise to go. Once we're done with this last exercise, we're going to end with a little bit of a cool down. Letting that body, that heart rate return to normal. But first, starting back up with our punches in five, four, three, two, one. Let's work. Reach and twist. Thirty more seconds. Over halfway. Keep working, keep that pace up. 15 more seconds to go. In five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Great work. Hit stop on that timer. Let's end with a little bit of a cool down. Since we were just moving, I want you to go back that side to side step. We're gonna slow down that pace, allowing that heart rate to come back down, our breathing to return to normal, taking it slower and slower. We're gonna do two more steps each side. Next, I want you to do a little bit of a wide stance for me, feet a little bit wider than shoulders, toes pointing forward. We're gonna end with some hip circles, bringing those hips over to the right, swiveling them forward to the left. 
back, and then switch directions, bringing hips back to the left, forward, right, and back up nice and tall. All right, that's all the exercises I have for you all today. Thanks for joining. Hope you got a good, quick little workout in.